and needed some coins to build that dream team you guys have always wanted, make sure to head on over to my sponsor, Buy Madden Coins. They have the cheapest, the quickest, and most reliable coins on the market right now. Head on over to Buy Madden Coins and use code Poodle at checkout for 20% off your order. What's going on, everybody? It's Poodle back with another Madden Ultimate Team video, guys. Today, let me go over what you guys want to be doing with your coins before the NFL Combine promo. Now, if you guys don't already know, just give you guys some of the details. If you haven't already, I recommend you go check out my 10:30 video, guys. The NFL Combine promo does drop tomorrow at approximately 10:30 Eastern time, the usual. Now, if you guys didn't see already, the special stream was this morning, which kind of went over pretty much everything we wish we will mostly be seeing. It wasn't three parts though. I don't know if that was that. Should, I mean, that was supposed to be everything. I mean, they could be like there's probably maybe might be some like LTDs in there, some solos, maybe a house rules at some point. But remember, it is a work in progress, so not everything is always going to be out at the moment of the special stream. But it pretty much covered just about everything we need to know at that moment. So pretty, pretty stereotypical. Not stereotypical. I'm going to say pretty atypical. Whatever promo. We're getting some solos. We're getting a borderline free type player with DK Metcalf. We're getting some evolution card type evolution card. We're getting a master set. We're getting some great players. Now, there's going to probably be more than just that than we saw. Like I said, those are just like the heroes and the master. But I do anticipate that we will probably get some LTDs in there. Maybe like combine LTD, like a Mariota or a McCaffrey or a Patrick Peterson. Because we usually get a Pat Pete and LTD Pat Pete would be pretty awesome. But I'm super excited. Now, before we get into the video and I go over what I think you should be doing with your coins to prepare for this promo, make sure to below. Enter the giveaway, guys. Every 80 likes is 10K. So all you got to do to enter is subscribe to the channel. Like the video, comment down below your system and your say system accounts, your system, and oh, that's it. Just your number, like you are. That's pretty much it. And you're interested, one guys. Let's get into this video. So, the master guys is Deion Sanders. So I want to let you guys know now, real quick. The master is going to be 97 Deion Sanders. So you definitely want this Deion Sanders. That's end game right there. That is going to be a godlike card. Gonna be probably one of the last Deion Sanders we get for most of the year. Let's be like a golden ticket or something. I don't really think we'll get another one. Let's give us an ultimate legend Deion on top of that, which would be kind of weird. Kind of messed up that they do do that, but. Deion Sanders, for the most part, probably going to be going for as a master, probably like 650k, 700k. Initially, it'll be up. He'll eventually come down, you know. Don't, don't stress it. But let's go check out the price of Deion for all you guys who want to power him up. I'll give you guys my best advice on that. So, Deion Sanders, 310k. He was like more like 240, 230 prior. So, he did go up a lot. He might even go up more tomorrow. If you have Deion Sanders, guys, I recommend tomorrow when he does drop, hold on to him. If you have him, maybe sell him tomorrow, make some coins on him. And you can use your power pass in place of him. Now, if you guys want the 97, right, and you don't know how to get him, you know the coins easy use your 97 power pass so my thought process right now is i might take my power pass off of saquon and put it onto this deon sanders tomorrow uh, and then i'm probably gonna end up going ahead and picking up the saquon by himself depending on the price you know it all comes down to who's more expensive now i'm assuming saquon will be less expensive than deon sanders that's also just my assumption i could be entirely wrong let's go check that out so for all you guys saquon's 469 it really depends we're gonna have to wait till tomorrow to see Who's more expensive, but 97 Deion Sanders probably kept up, maxed out everything. Couldn't probably be a 99 on my team. So I'm super excited for that. So that's just my best recommendation. Now remember, Deion Sanders set pieces will be going for probably pretty expensive in the next few days, or at least a week. So don't just, if you don't have them already all powered up, you're gonna have a, you're gonna have a really expensive uh, time trying to get them. So I wouldn't really recommend you go that route. Gonna be way too expensive. Let's see, Series Redux, Deion Sanders. Yeah, going for 265. And uh, Denzel Ward, same thing. Go for pretty expensive now because of this card. I have to have both powered up, so I'm pretty excited. Now, recommended coin stack going to this promo. If you want to do the master set, right? You're gonna need a million, a million plus, easy. Kamara, you're gonna probably need a million just to do the set. But remember, all you gotta do is have the million up front to do the set, and then you can sell them all. You can sell Dion and make your coins back. You don't really need a million to actually spend. You need a million to do the set. Now, if you just want Dion by himself, just buying him out, right? You probably need about 600k in my opinion. Probably 600k is what I'm thinking. He'll set all around. If you want to just get like one of them heroes, heroes are probably go. Let's see, the heroes are about what are they? 97 overalls? No, 96 overalls. They'll probably be like 250, 300. I think day one when the set and everything, they're probably gonna be like 340. And then once everything comes down a little bit, they'll probably end up capping around like 270. But that's gonna take some time. So for the time being, if you want one, you're gonna need about 350k, 330. Well, if you want all of them, you need a million coins. And you could also get Dion that way too. You can get all of them probably about a million coins. Which isn't a bad deal. They're all really great cards. Alvin Kamara's kind of ass, but he wouldn't be a bad backup running back. You put like route specials on him or something, or whatever you can get running back apprentice, and you can make make a really great out of the backfield type back on passing downs, which I do pass a lot of my running backs, or I throw lots of my running backs. So that would be pretty awesome for me. Denzel Ward super fast. Like I said, the combine is the athletic promo, so you're gonna have a crazy fast 99 speed Denzel Ward, 99 speed Deion, Deion Sanders. I was kind of hoping, guys, that we would have saw Leon Sandcastle make his return for this combine. A nice little 98 overall master Leon Sandcastle combine card. That would have been super awesome. We haven't gotten that in quite a while. But beyond that, coin stack, like I said, 
I would recommend you start building up your coin stack now. Cards aren't I, cards aren't crazy expensive right now. It's kind of about average, but I don't know. Like lower cards are gonna go down, guys. I mean, go up. So I'd recommend if you have a lot of things in your binder, don't bind yourself just yet. If it's lower cards, like 80 overall, it's like 83 overall base leads. I recommend you hold on to them because tomorrow they are releasing sets such as like exchange sets for low overall leads to get uh, combine cards. So low cards should be going up like 80 to 81s could be going up to like maybe 5k maybe 6k it's only an extra k or two but if you have like 10 of these cards for an extra k or two that's an extra 20k you can make some decent coins on these i wouldn't recommend you sell them now you'll probably end up losing a little bit 82 to 83 is around 3k as well which i'd click the same thing again and then 84 to 85s i believe are also in the exchange set so let's see 6k again they're super cheap but if you use properly you could make a pretty decent return on these now as far as the higher overall cards it's all down to your discretion when you think you want you want to wait to see the cards first i mean we kind of already know the stats these cards are pretty expensive in terms of what they were like team of the year cards you can make a decent buck back on team of the year cards the issue with team of the year cards is that everyone thought they were going to get overshadowed by the combine and all these new promos but then they ended up all being 96 overalls anyway so they're kind of coming back up in price as people still kind of like these cards but i don't think they'll last for much longer so if you have some and you want to build up your coin stack for them i recommend you maybe shed some team of the year weight because ultimate legends are only going to get higher in overall combine cards are super athletic super glitchy except for kamar like i said he's, he's average but i'd recommend you shed some weight i'm gonna be dropping some players probably tonight sell some things off build up my coin stack a little bit and then you know just wait because obviously i want some combine cards i mean Deion sandcastle is a must Deion sandcastle Deion sanders is a must now would i recommend buying right now no i think you wait for these combine cards you gotta see what the, you gotta see at least see it at least see how they affect the market and then beyond that see if you want some of the cards i think Deion sanders is a must Denzel Ward, I'm going to use because he's powered up, so I think I'm going to actually take him. 99 man, 99 speed, 99 press. Kind of glitchy. Alan Kamara, I might just take as a backup. And I can't quite recall who the other one was by any means. Oh, Amari Cooper. Amari Cooper's decent again. Like, again, the heroes aren't the best, but they do that specifically so you can't get a disadvantage of having three Nat cards that are amazing and then having the mash that's amazing. They can purposely know what they're doing. But again, not bad cards overall. Kemped up, powered up, can still make some pretty good use out of them, even as a third or fourth receiver. Now, should you save coins for anything after this, guys? Following the combine promo, the only thing left after the combine, like that's like big, big. I mean, paths to the draft. Uh, I don't really know. We got combine. We got team MVPs. We got the combine already. We should be seeing a few other things, but it's not so much something that like it's gonna be huge like this. Like the next real big kind of thing is gonna be paths to the draft, of course. And then we have Ultimate Legends weekly. We have the Easter, which isn't just yet, but we don't entirely have anything that's like specific to this month or an upcoming like we have golden tickets but that's not near yet that's gonna be more like that's more of like an april may type of thing gold tickets are more towards may so next big pro this is probably one of the last big big promos we're gonna get like we got super bowl team mvps and combine one of the last big ones in the path to the draft like i said but man's more old at that point so i think in my opinion this might be one of the last big promos that affect things so i wouldn't recommend you go all in like i said pick up the players you guys need but ultimate legends are going to start getting a lot better after this so if you have any combine cards you really really want power them up, them up they're going to be all end game for the most part i don't really see any of them not being end game besides kamara like dion denzel ward um cooper's decent but i think we're gonna get some ltds so my hope is guys save a little bit of coins because i'm telling you if they drop a pat pete ltd you're gonna want that pat pete i can't see a way where they don't drop a chris johnson or pat pete ltd because we did get a chris johnson earlier in the year i'd be kind of ashamed if we didn't it'd be shame for the first year ever we didn't get a vernon davis chris johnson or pat pete so i'm waiting i think they could drop him at some point i definitely want those so by all me in i don't mean don't touch the promo i mean the day one don't go all in just yet because there's a decent chance we'll get more and this promo is in three parts i feel like dion can't be the only master we probably should be getting another two masters they only announced that one so far so i'm thinking what that means is that there will be another two masters such as like maybe a pat peterson master or a vernon davis master or odell master i don't really know just my personal advice don't go all in tomorrow dion sank if you have enough coins for dion sanders by all means do the set no problem doing it but if you're, if you're gonna read penny pinching and you're not gonna be able to enjoy the rest of the promo do not because this is just the beginning if Deion sanders is just part one which again i could be wrong it could just be one master of everything but i'm saying if i feel like there's gonna be some ltds in there i can't imagine that they go without the, the typical staples for this but guys that is about it for the video hope you guys did enjoy if you're into the channel make sure you're down below hit that subscribe button turn the notify boys come join the family make sure to enter the giveaway i will be posting the giveaway winners for the last three days on the community tab so stay tuned for that easiest way to do it i feel like if i do it in a video and you don't watch the video and you won kind of sucks and i really have no other way to like directly contact you other than twitter but you have to contact me on there because i don't know what your twitter is and i have mine in my description as well so you know how to contact me if you do win but guys it's better for the video thank you so much for watching enter the giveaway like comment and subscribe 
to enter, comment down below your system and the number of like you are. Once you do all those things, you're ready to win. Good luck. Enjoy the rest of your day. I'll probably only post two videos today. And guys, with all the content tomorrow, I'll probably be back on three to four vids, at least for another few days, or at least for until the end of this promo. So enjoy. I'm out. Peace.